Hey guys, so today we're going to take a look at one of the first prints off of this printer. This is going to be the Hicktop D3 Hero 3D printer. Uh, it's a dual extrusion machine, so it's got two extruders to it. Uh, there's no color mixing head to it whatsoever. Uh, this printer is very heavy built. It's got a linear rail right system to it. It uh, doesn't have any of the rollers when it comes to the x-axis to it. It does have rollers when it comes to the y uh, and of course on the Z as well. But uh, we're going to go ahead and try out one of the first prints on I started a print during the live stream which I'll put a link to it right up there somewhere. <laughs> and uh, during the live stream I started a print and the print fell because I didn't clean the glass. I didn't put any glue down or anything. So we're going to correct that. We're going to print the same exact model I started on the, on the live stream. And let's see how it turns out. So I'll set everything up and I'll see you at the end of the time lapse. I love the way the screen is set up. Done printing file. 5 hours, 48 minutes. That is the clearest screen I've ever seen where it actually shows me the time. It's so much easier to read than most of the printers I've ever, ever dealt with. Okay, let's take a look at this print. That actually turned out really good. Let's get it over here closer. Closer. Okay, so the prime tower <clears throat> is in pretty rotten shape, which is to be expected because you have the, the two extruders coming to the prime tower, and thankfully the hairs go to the prime tower as it's doing whatever it's doing. But let's see how this turned out. That's going to be a little bit tight. I did use that, that uh, glue on it. Let's try to find a nice safe spot to start lifting the print from. Okay, come around the back of them here. There we go. Oh, I just broke a foot. Ah, I hate that when it happens. That's all right. Just a little bit of a casualty. Oh, that's unfortunate. That was all on me, though. That was my fault. Now, once again, this model here was the one that was on the SD card. So, I'm not exactly sure what the settings were for it. I'll glue his foot on later. <laughs> Bottom of it is like glass very smooth which is understandable because you are printing on glass but look at how clean the colors are now I've only dealt with uh, two color printing with the mixing heads like on the GTEx this is the first time I've ever had one that did two color using two different extruders and I'm sold <laughs> that is clean very clean. It's just unfortunate that broke off. But look at how clean that print looks. I'm trying to see if there's any problem with layer lines. And I am just not seeing any issues at all with that. I don't see any Z wobble at all. Everything's nice and smooth. Not sure what the layer height is for that model. Not sure at all on that. Looks very clean. So once I get a uh, profile set up in this printer and uh, on Kira, it'll be interesting to see what layer height. It could be 0.1 layer height. Could be, but we'll see. Anyway. 
not bad for the first print. I'm very happy with that. The machine did a great job on it. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Take care, and I'll catch you in the next one.